Hi, Dr. Tyra Jones, I'm back again. And I wanna to talk to you about hiring uh, financial services professionals for your business. Now, this particular topic is, I'm kind of biased, honestly, because we are in the financial services industry because it is very important for you to understand that there's two sides of your business. There's the operational side of your business, which really and truly, you're probably great at no one is better than you in the operational side of your business than you are you know you know how to deliver the services you know how to operate your business but there's another side of your business which in some industries uh well with some companies they call it the business of your business or the financial side of your business and that's typically not the side of a business that most people are really really astute to so you have to hire you know professionals such as myself in order to help you along with either filing your corporate taxes deciding on when to graduate your entity um, setting up your accounting system also pretty much organizing your finances so that you can scale right because at some point you're going to want to grow your business into something different your vision is already there you just operating it so that you can get to where your vision is so you want to work with a professional who not only is a professional in their own industry but also identifies your vision they should be asking you questions about the future more so than your past. A lot of times that, you know, uh, business owners want, wonder, well, why did my CPA teach me this? And why did my accountant teach me this? Or why didn't they tell me about these uh, different programs? Well, typically individuals in our industry, people who deal with numbers, we're dealing with data, right? we don't we, we can't it's almost like we're robots we can't function until there's data but guess what by the time the data is transferred to them that is in the past right that's information from what you did on the operational side which is bringing the revenue we're we're working with the data after you have done what you do so what you want to have is someone who is uh, professional at what they do, knowledgeable at what, what they do in the financial side of your business, but also forecasts. Also have a mindset of uh, thinking forward in terms of your goals and your dreams and your visions of your business. So there are a lot of conversations that you should be having with your CPA and or your accountant on a quarterly basis that have everything to do with where you're going and not necessarily where you have been. Now, I know that we're talking about financial you know, services, accountants, CPAs, but there's a professional that you really need to have in your corner as well, and that's an attorney. You really need to have an attorney in your corner, but I know a lot of small businesses starting out, you really, you know, you may say, I can't afford an attorney. Well, we have some resources in this particular lesson where you can take advantage of finding out more information about uh, legal services in regards to your legal structure, in regards to advice on your taxes, you know, and these services are just a, an accompaniment to the individuals whom you've already hired already in your business. So anytime that you want to explore or that you need to explore or you're being advised to explore different professionals who can actually help you to properly run your business, this is not to replace the people you have right now. This is to add to the knowledge that you already have coming from those individuals. And then in a lot of cases, like from our experiences, we work with a lot of our clients, CPAs and accountants. And they've learned a lot from us because we're more so, we're kind of a different entity, right? So, and we've learned from them. So just understand that these professionals are very important in your business. And not only that, it's important for you to be able to learn from them. So with that being said, I know you have some things in this particular lesson that you have to get taken care of. So go ahead and do that. And I'll see you in the next video.